My name is Mary Alto, and I'm a breast cancer survivor. In their minds, the biggest question is, will my cancer come back? And in our minds, as a cancer center, if the cancer is going to come back, how do we ensure we catch it early? It's a huge question mark, and it's a giant emotional issue. You feel like you live under the sword of Damocles. When you have no evidence of disease using standard approaches, unfortunately, it doesn't actually mean that there isn't disease present. So the idea is it's to understand whether a woman at the end of therapy has been cured of breast cancer or not, to identify biomarkers that could detect something called minimal residual disease at the end of treatment that would then be a predictor of recurrence. Dr. Salia's lab is really hoping to develop a blood test that would actually give uh, us an idea as patients of what sort of risk we have uh, in terms of recurrence. We have identified a liquid biopsy strategy using cell-free DNA methylation as our minimal residual disease biomarker approach. It's really looking for the needle in the haystack. The first is to identify minimally residual disease. The second is we're using artificial intelligence to develop multivariable models to predict the likelihood that a patient will have a recurrence. What a godsend. It would change our lives.